So Helldivers, a lot is going on with the game right now and we are just moments away from getting one of the biggest updates of this year. So there's still going to be so much more added for 2024 but this is definitely one of the most exciting ones and we're going to be talking all about it in today's video. The first thing we're going to be talking about is the brand new mech leak. There is a new mech coming to the game as a brand new stratagem and I'm going to be putting a video on the screen for you guys to see it. It looks absolutely amazing. This leak came from Helldivers Alert, so big shout out to them. Also, the Illuminate is arriving very soon and there already has been all these different types of like blue beams and things firing down from the sky, which apparently people have been saying has actually been injuring them in the game. So if you guys do enjoy all of these Helldivers news updates, I, I post them daily on my channel. Please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel as it means a lot to me. And let's get on with the video. I am going to play you guys right now the um, leak uh, for the new Emancip Emancipator, I'm going to say, um, which is uh, the brand new mech. So you guys enjoy that and I'll catch you in a second. So yeah, it looks really cool. Um, it seems to have like some form of like, it's got like two Gatlin guns, um, it seems like on the side and uh, it looks like to be like it's going to be very good against the automatons, which is uh, which is the coolest thing about it. I'm looking forward to seeing it. It's, it's kind of an explosive gun on the side. And uh, as we can see from the clip as well, it comes straight down from a plane being dropped off as another stratagem. Just like how we had the most recent mech, the XO45, um, which was again, a it's been there's been like 50 50 responses to that mech some people saying it's not very good against the robots some people are saying it's pretty good um and uh, you let me know what you think about it but this new one hopefully should cause a lot of damage to the robots this time with the explosive guns coming off the side so yeah that looks absolutely amazing and i can't wait to see what it's going to be like in game now, this is onto the blue beams and uh, and about the Illuminate, and it says, why Helldivers 2 players are convinced the Illuminate are coming? So while most Helldivers 2 players are busy fending off the, uh, the bugs and the robots, some believe they've seen evidence that a third faction called the Illuminate are on their way. Players of the first Helldivers game will be f uh, familiar with the Illuminate, an ancient technology advanced alien civilization hell-bent on destroying Super-Earth. Now, with Helldivers 2 out for over a month, players have reported seeing odd blue lasers that cause damage if they hit. Um, so, also something that's been going on with the game is the cyborgs. A lot of people are saying that the cyborgs um, are actually going to be making an appearance too into the game, um, which they'd been trapped on a planet which the Helldivers have been kind of keeping them in uh, like uh, like sort of kind of as their prisoners but in a way but just sort of trying to make them not fight and uh, and there's links to how the cyborgs will be getting freed by the other robots and come and attack us so there's all different types of things going on right now and there's been one player spotted on the cyborg planet which everyone thinks is good is actually joel but that will be weird so one redditor reported saying a vibrant blue laser shot um shot and knocked them down to around 60 hp it must have been an illuminate sniper just like the first game and the sniper must teleported out immediately after the shot i wish i was screen recording at the time or had anything like that set up other players have provided footage showing this blue laser sniper shot the arrival of the illuminate would not come as much a surprise given the models for the faction have leaked and there's even in-game news broadcast on your ship that's uh, that speaks of rumors of the illuminate sightings and they do not look like they are going to be very friendly um I'll, I'll show on the screen some really cool leaks of what they look like i'm sure you've seen them on some other videos because helldivers alerts posted and it has like over like nearly thirty thousand likes on the tweet um so arrowhead ceo johan tweeted to deny the existence of these mysterious 
mysterious blue beams in typical universe fashion saying blue beams aren't real it can't hurt you and well super earth would say that wouldn't it um, Helldivers 2, um, a recent premium warbond, has an arc theme and adds a number of arc theme weapons with um, armor which has arc resistance and some players have speculated that this gear is designed to play well with the Illuminate when the aliens eventually turn up on the map. Um, so yeah, uh, if you're looking obviously to see a lot more about this, there's bunches of posts and everything um, that we've seen so far on them coming to jo join us in the battle. And um, if you're one of, if you're like a Helldivers player that's experienced the first game, I've been really tempted to actually purchase the first one and uh, go and have a look at some things that could be coming in the future because um, a lot of people kind of have like inside info. If you didn't see my video, um, the uh, there was like two, three days ago, there was also so Hive Lord um, spottings around the map, which some people have said have been in since the start of the game, but some other people have been saying that there's more of the Hive Lord bones appearing all around the map. So, so far when we look at everything we've got at the moment, we've got the um, potential of the Illuminate coming very soon through these blue beams. We've got the Cyborgs um, potentially making a return after them having a rebellion on their planet to come and attack the Helldivers. And we've got other future bosses that are meant to be coming to the game as i said with the hive lord which is going to be part of the bug faction and uh, yeah so there is so much happening for the game and we just don't know which way it's going to happen if they're all going to come for us at once or if they'll do it one by one i think they'll be doing it one by one and i absolutely love how um arrowhead are kind of teasing us with all these little bits of things uh, you know moving forward with the game and i think um when the new um when the new uh, war bond, uh, well, no, when the new major order uh, finishes, I reckon we could be seeing something pretty big with the Illuminate. Now, if you are the Illuminate, sorry. Um, so, if you're, uh, please let me know again, as I said earlier, if you are part, if you have played a lot of the first game, and maybe some other features that you think could come when they do launch um, onto the game. There'll be more planets to visit. I just want to visit the Cyborg planet. You know, what was it Cyberstan? I think it's called. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be absolutely amazing. So. So as I said, I will be keeping you guys up to date with constant Helldivers 2 news as we move closer onto these new updates. The mech looks absolutely fantastic. I wonder how these arc weapons are going to play. Um, I'm sure you'll, the armor, the certain armor that we've unlocked with the new war bond is, I hope this doesn't link to players again talking about how it's going to be pay to win because you have to have this war bond, um, uh, the, the, uh, this war bond to be able to, uh, you know, take less damage from the Illuminate and stuff like that. Let's hope that isn't this kept the case because, again, it's, it's up to you. Your, your team help you. If you're one of your teammates has the armor and you don't have the armor, it doesn't mean that it's going to be a, you know, a pay-to-win scenario. Your team are still there to help you and fight against all of the new creatures that we're going to be fighting. Anyway, guys, that is going to be your full update video today. Thank you so much for uh, just sharing the videos out recently. I've been having so much fun. Um, and also, what levels are you guys now? Because uh, I've seen some people have been smashing, um, uh, like absolutely smashing it through the levels at the moment. Um, managed to play a little bit over the weekend too, which was great uh, as we get closer. Because you need you need to let me level up and grind in the game to be able to unlock all of the new war bond stuff. So uh, anyway, thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in my next video very soon. See you guys then.